What's going on, YouTube? This is Trainer Connor. You're watching one of my narrated Wi-Fi battle videos. And, um, yeah, this is actually a really fun match between myself and Ruins Way, one of my awesome rivals here. And we're going to be using some very unconventional Pokemon in this battle. So, first up, we've got a Choice Band Infernape, Iron Fist. Um, a Mega Absol, and this one is actually a Shiny Absol that I got from a giveaway. A Life Orb Kyurem, regular Hoopa Unbound, and a Substitute Source Dance Bisharp, that's Justice, and then Pale Glow Manaphy. If you look at my opponent's team, he's got a Pelipper, a Bell Fox, Stoutland, Hawks Crow, Warmadam, and a Mega Manectric. So the only things I have to worry about are going to be Mega Manectric, possibly Hawks Crow, and I think that's it because everyone else is too frail to take a hit. So we're going to start with my Choice Band in front of me because I could probably hit a few things with it. But then I noticed he has a, uh, a nice shiny Pelipper to start out, we're going to go for U-Turn. I don't have a Thunder Punch on this particular Infernape. We're going to go into Justice right now, expecting a Hurricane. And very obviously, we take it very well, and we do not get confused by it. That's one of the few times that I don't get confused by that move. And uh, I know he's going to probably switch out, because another Hurricane will not take me out. So we're going to go with a substitute as he brings in Warmagam. And this particular Warmagam parka is ground type, I would imagine. So um, I know I'm faster than this thing, so we're going to set up a source dance to boost up my attacking power. He shows me Earthquake. That's going to definitely take out my substitute that I have up. And then we can hopefully revenge kill this parka, the Warmagam, with an Iron Head. We do not kick it out, but we do get the flinch, and that's kind of important because... Well, actually, since I'm faster than it, then I guess the flinch didn't matter. Um, the point is, we're going to finish off Warm Again with another nice slash, or just one, really. And there you go, we got our first uh, KO in this battle, so... Great job, Justice. This particular bit sharp, I had a uh, sense Pokemon Black and White, so... I know this guy very well. Now, unfortunately for me, uh, he has a Mega Manetric. When I realized, oh wait, I have Defiant. And Defiant is Bisharp's ability. Defiant will boost up your attacking power by two stages if the opponent has Intimidate. But it doesn't matter here, mainly because Mega Manetric is going to be faster. And he gets to knock me out with a Flamethrower. Now we get to try out Archangel here. Archangel, the um, Mega Absol. And this particular Absol, it's really frail. As you see here, I don't take a Volt Switch all too well, but then uh, this particular uh, Absol does not have a Sucker Punch or anything like that. It has Knock Off, Clay Rough, Ice Beam, and Flamethrower. So it's a little bit weird, but. Um, the coverage is there, so unfortunately for me, he gets to bring in Hawks Crow, and Hawks Crow is really good. Um, Sucker Punch is able to finish me off from that range of HP, but now this is going to be a nice showcase. No, I, I could have worded that better. Uh, this is actually a premiere showing of my Kyurem here. This shiny Kyurem I also got from an event, and uh, this one is Life Orb. So this is going to do a ton of damage. We take out Hawks Crow there, and we almost take out uh, Stoutland. Unfortunately for him, he gets to miss a play rough there. I don't know if I would have KO'd. I am taking Life Orb recoil damage every turn. So it might have. If he had a critical hit there, then that would have been terrible. But uh, he misses a Hurricane with his Makogo here. Makogo. The Pelipper, that 
must have mattered too because I probably would have gotten confused and uh, it might actually hail from that range. I don't know. So we'll be able to take out Huddlebird from that range if HP there. And now he gets to bring in Manectric, who actually takes an Ice Beam. I was a little bit surprised by this. So he's gonna finish me off. But Karen, you did a great job in this battle. You took out three Pokemon just all by yourself there. And that's, that's self-determination there. Now we're gonna bring in Hoopa. This Hoopa has a Dunk Shot, Drain Punch, Hyper Space Hole, and a Psychic. I go for Drain Punch. I was not aware of Delphox coming in. But we do get to restore a little bit of HP, but uh, not going to save me from a Delphox there. So expecting a fire type move or a psychic type move, predicting a switch, I'm going to try out this amazing Manaphy. I used this Manaphy in a Periscope stream where you get to stream live Wi-Fi battles there, or from my case at least. And I used Manaphy a lot in those battles and this thing is really good so we get to try it out we set up a tail glow and we uh finish off delphox not too much of a problem there now his last pokemon is actually mega manetric uh this thing is really strong and it's really fast too so i can't outspeed it but then i can go into hoopa i was hoping that a thunderbolt i could survive and we Barely hold on, we get to finish off this Madexic with a hyperspace hole. So that was a great battle, but we have some more battles that I have to post between myself and Flair. So be on the lookout for that. Um, this was actually a really fast battle because we had to, like, we ordered our food from our, uh, the restaurant that we were at. And uh, so we had to have a quick battle, but that was still a fun match. So I hope you all enjoyed. Make sure you like this video. Subscribe and I'll see you in the next Wi-Fi Bell video. Alright, goodbye, Chance.